A first of its kind club opening today in Massachusetts. And it's sparking new interest in a sport that's been gaining popularity. Zach took a trip to Hanover to check it out. It just it was a family that uh, they started playing it in their backyard. From backyard beginnings to a professional sport, pickleball is quickly gaining popularity in the United States. The way it became uh, called pickleball was their dog's name was Pickles. Paying homage to the sport's namesake, Juana Melandi and Lisa Demerit are the proud owners of Pickles in Hanover. With their grand opening today, this pickleball only club is rallying new players to their court. It's really all ages and all shapes and sizes. It's you don't have to be a superstar athlete to play this game. Walking onto a pickleball court, you'll quickly realize it resembles a few different sports. It's a cross between uh, tennis, badminton, and ping pong. It's played with a hard ball, like a wiffle ball, but really hard and a paddle versus a tennis racket. But the aim of this game is more subtle. It's a finesse sport if you really play it. There is a lot of slamming and hitting, but it's, it is finesse. Finesse is not something I'm all too familiar with, but there was one part of the game I knew exactly how to avoid. The kitchen is where you want to stay out of. My wife doesn't like me in the kitchen. I should have known. The kitchen is the blue part here, so up to the line. You, can, you can't stand and stay in the kitchen. You can't slam in the kitchen or even follow through into the kitchen. Staying out of the kitchen comes easily enough. Amounting a pickleball comeback is another story. Don't call it a comeback. It's a competitive sport with players volleying for a win. We win! <laughs> but no matter what, the game always ends with a paddle high five. That's a really nice thing about, um, about pickleball is it's um, a community. And that community is of all ages and all skill levels as well. It seems pretty easy to pick up even if you haven't had a paddle in your hand before. Lisa and Juana mentioned they want to open five more clubs like this in the state, just in Massachusetts in the future. I can remember playing this maybe a little bit in middle school. Yeah. But then now when you drive around, you see pickleball courts and all kinds of people. It's become a fad. Yeah, it was initially in a backyard. A lot of people would just build courts in their driveways. And now they have full clubs for it too. So it seems like it's going to be gaining popularity. Get a little pickleball WBZ this morning team going. I love it. Yeah, Brianna and I versus Liam and Kate. <laughs> yes. I like it. Kate I like would that matchup. Yes. I it would, would take her two seconds. Yeah. Yeah.